I think that we've engineered the the uh, possibility of a failure to escape from lunar orbit uh, to an acceptable level. As you know, the, the service module engine has been tested, I guess, more than any of the other components on the vehicle. And when you look at the overall mission, you come away with the realization that as any of these missions go, any of the lunar missions go, it's a conservative mission. Now, I, I, I don't believe in the trite saying that, the, you know, uh, you're accepting more risk by driving on a freeway or something like that. As far as I'm concerned, that's nonsense. Yeah. But uh, the business is risky, and uh, I think we've accepted a, a minimal amount of, uh, of unknowns on this flight. And it's one of the nice things about it. We've taken, and, and instead of having one huge giant step to put with a lunar mission with a lamb on and a rendezvous and everything else, we've broken it down into a more acceptable pattern. Is there a risk, <coughs> excuse me, is there a risk equation you, Bill, and Jim have? I mean, do you equate this in your own mind to being less or more than a freeway, less or more than flying a T-38 or F-4 or whatever? All right. I, I, uh, I equate it to uh, much more than that. I look, I look at it as something like a, uh, perhaps a uh, combat tour in Vietnam.